today we are going to discuss does we get the less production in the organic farming than conventional farming this is the most commonly question asked in various platform and also in person and this is questions is the most debated question in the farming sector i am going to uh, attend these questions in depth in this particular video see when uh, these questions comes where whether you get the less production in the organic farming here you should understand to which farming we are calling the organic farming in this case we are considering the organic farming means the farming which has got the organic certification not the farming which is just claim as organic farming or natural farming or conventional farming i am here talking about the organic farming which has the proper organic certification of any organic standards now when you are doing any uh, farming by using the chemical fertilizer chemical pesticide that is called conventional farming when we convert our farm from conventional farming to organic farming when we apply for the organic certification and we get the first certification that is conversion period first year certification that is also called the c1 certification what is this conversion period this conversion period is the period which required to convert your conventional farm into organic farm mostly under various standard it is a, a, a period of 3 years first year you get the c1 certificate that conversion period one certificate then second year c2 certificate all this i have explained in uh, uh, other video what is conversion period how to get organic certification for your farm and all those things we have discussed in the uh, other video now here our main focus is does we get the less production than the conventional farming in organic farming see sometime yes and sometime no this both answers are true how i will explain see when you convert your conventional farm in the organic farm in that conversion period one you still have the some residue of uh, chemical fertilizers chemical pesticide in your farm and because of that chemical residue the microorganism cycle which cell produce or cell release nutrients from the soils is can't built uh, efficiently because in the presence of chemical uh, those microorganism cannot grow their life cycle cannot get developed and they doesn't function effectively so you may get the less production again due to use of chemical fertilizers you may have developed some salts in your farm which doesn't uh, break down to the nutrients so it doesn't make available to the plant so in conversion period one that is the, in the first year you may get the some uh, less production maybe by 20 or 30 percent means you may get 70 to 80 percent production as compared to your conventional farm so is this less production means are you going going in the loss or are you going to get the less revenue or less profit in this not at all see when you certify your product certify your farm for the organic farming it may be the conversion period one but it is still organic and when it is organic there is a big demand for the organic product and you get the better price than your conventional production and that is the beauty behind this less production means you have the less production but your market demand is high your price is high so even the in the less production price is high so you get the assured higher income than the conventional farming in the conventional farming you need to struggle to sell your product but here there is a big demand for the organic product and again you are getting the better price so your profitability will be the absolutely high so uh, you might have heard you might have seen the suppose organic rice or any other product organic vegetables organic fruits always sold at the higher price than conventional fruits and conventional products so something you are uh, selling for the 100 rupees in the conventional farm it will surely have the 150 or 200 rupees price in organic farming 
This way, even though your production is less, you are getting the higher profit due to the higher price. Secondary, you are not using the costly chemical fertilizers, you are not using the costly pesticides, you are using the compost, cow dung or traditional fertilizers which you can manufacture in your own farm and you can use them. So your production cost is also less. Even the product production is less, but production cost is more or less and you are getting the higher price. So your profitability is more, profit margin is more. So don't get afraid of the less production in the organic farming. And this less production is only for first and second year. Uh, from the third year, 99% farmer get the 100% production or more than 100% production. And that too, with the less production cost, higher demand and higher price. So, uh, from the third year, you are the 100% organic, your certificate is not conversion period, it is a complete organic certificate. So, you will get the higher and higher income from the organic farming. This is the beauty of the organic farming and this is the correct answer of the organic farming, whether you get the less production than conventional or whether you get the less income than conventional. In the organic farming, it, if it is a less production, still you get the more profit and more revenue from the organic farming. And this is the all about answer of this question. If you have any such questions or if you are struggling anything in the organic farming or the if you are if you want to ask something about the business opportunity in the organic sector, feel free to contact me through this channel or you can communicate directly with me. And wishing you all the best for your all organic farming activity and all organic business activity. Thank you.